So next up, we're going to chat about the Asterians, the ancient secret of alien race. So gentlemen, what can you tell me about them? On the first pass of the uh, Asterians, it looks kind of like a very traditional army. Yeah. You've got your marionettes. Now the marionettes are actually, you know, robots because Asterians are too valuable to deploy in big numbers. Yeah. So the Asterian is up in the ship, up in off-world grav, and they're remotely connected to the marionette and that runs into the battlefield, which I think is going to be very cool and yeah. uh, good fun. So you've got your, your troops aren't even troops, they're robots. Then you've got your, your Sky Razors, your Black Talons, your Cyphers. This is the next level up. They're very good at doing a specific thing. Yeah. These, these add the speed, they add the glamour. Matsudan, cool sumo warrior, Japanese ninja lizards. <laughs> uh, Kalishi, Asterians who want the buzz of an actual combat, so come down in almost, you know, yeah. on any clothing and a razor to get in there. Tanks, they're your tactical punch. But the whole thing on the first level is each thing does one thing well. Yeah. But the skill of the general is to make sure that your Matsudan are going in and battling to take out objectives and clear out space. The Kalishi are super quick. Yeah. Each bit, the speed, there's glamour, there's punch, but you've got to be quite surgical. You've got to be quite clever with how you use it. Yeah. But. <laughs> uh, and this is where the uh, the alien tech, you know, that... that, yeah. that that, that that enigmatic stuff that uh, that they is kind of the aura around them. So their uh, some of their abilities are things like energize. So you know they they're using this to predict enemy actions. Uh, this is what we're trying to represent here. So <laughs> you know those got, command con command counters. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you know you can. So a lot, a lot of you guys are going to have saves from the alien tech. Uh, they can energize those saves. So if they if they look at it and think I'm going to get shot here, yeah. and that looks like it's going to be a bucket load of dice, energize your shields and improve your save values. Nice. Um, now it's a bit of a gamble. They might miss completely, but, <laughs> but there you go. Um, and one of the other really cool things they've got is uh, is vibro shield. So any 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 unit can do that. So if again, if they're looking at something, I'm going to get charged here. Activate your vibro shield. The the enemy unit might then suddenly not be able to charge you at all. You might be suddenly out of range. In which yeah. case, they're kind of milling around, <laughs> and the rest of your army goes, "Great, what a nice juicy target!" <laughs> Brilliant, <laughs> really close. Yeah. Yeah. And it, and that's that alien bit, which was which was, I think was a whole load of fun to write. And you know you to get yeah. balanced, but the the command counters give you a guess what's coming, and then they can respond to that yeah and it doesn't always work but when it does work oh my lord <laughs> does the fun follow yeah and then the overseer almost double the overseer and the super heavy double down on this yeah absolutely so kind of so on the so as well as predicting you know you can also uh, uh, adapt to what to what's going on so the overseer has got a cunning keyword which uh, um, allows him to change the action token on on a on a, on a nearby unit nice. um and the and the big kind of the the mech yeah. um which is the ADIS Clade Warden, um, can pretty much do what they want. So they, they can actually spend command points yeah. um, to wants to change whatever the action they are. So, you know, I put them on sprint. Actually, that's not what the battlefield's doing. I'm going to spend those two command points. Right, I'm going on Overwatch or I'm yeah. doing, you know, w whatever I want. Um, and it can also... Once it's in combat and, and finished the combat, it can then it, once it can break away and then it can still fire its gun as well. So you know it can it can it's basically it's it's got all the tools it, it, <laughs> it, it needs. It does everything. Yeah, yeah. It, it doesn't do anything, but yeah. But whatever's the scenario, it just adapts to it. Yeah. And I think what you know, I'm not going to be too nice to Lesio Matt because <laughs> no one wants to do that. But this is the army that's so sophisticated, so clever. The yeah. way they've teased in this kind of alien, like anticipating and changing but in a really clear way clean yeah, way you know yeah. not argumentative like there's your cans we're going to respond by using the command points and adding that flavor yeah. and and it's just a very sophisticated very classy kind of yeah. Uh, army yeah it definitely sounds that anyway yeah, definitely like not what the next one we're going to talk about because they're just <laughs> stubborn grumpy on <laughs> so if you're feeling a bit more sophisticated and a little bit more uh, a bit more uppity I suppose mm -hmm. then you yeah. find why yeah yeah if you if you like the finer things in life maybe the Asterians are for you <laughs>